Windows Shortcuts Part 2. So if you are someone that copies and pastes a lot during your day and you see yourself going back and copying once again things that you copied two hours ago, you want to activate this shortcut. Press Windows plus V. It will activate your clipboard history and we will be able to copy up to 25 items. It can be text, it can be phrases, it can be images that we take screenshots from. And when we want to paste on any document, we just need to press once again Windows plus V and we will be able to select and paste the image or the text that we want. So this one is a must for someone that copies and pastes a lot towards the day. And if you enjoyed this first tip, don't forget that thumbs up right over there, which is really appreciated on this side of the screen and helps this video to reach more people. Now, we were talking about taking screenshots and copying tests. So if I want to take a screenshot, the shortcut is Windows plus Shift plus S, which will allow me to select an area of the screen, take that screenshot and copy it to my clipboard. Now I can paste it directly or if I have already the clipboard history activated, I can then press Windows plus V and paste the image that I just copied or anything else because it will be on my clipboard history. Now, if we have a lot of apps and windows open and we need to focus and we want to minimize everything, don't do it manually. Just use Windows plus M and it will minimize all the apps that we have. Now, once we have them minimized, we might want to use the shortcut with which is Windows plus T, and it will cycle through the apps that we have opened on our Windows taskbar. Another option is to use the Windows plus tab, which will open our virtual desktop, and we can then select the app that we want. And if you are watching this video on Windows 10 or 11 computer, and you still haven't activated and can't even edit your desktop icons, don't forget to check out cdksales.com where we can find budget official OM keys at an affordable price. And with the coupon code that you can see on screen and down below on the video description, it will get even cheaper. And to finish up, one of my favorites of this group, which I use every single day. If I want to select a lot of items or all the items in a folder, instead of selecting with the mouse, which can be a boring and frustrating experience, I just need to press Control A and it will select all the files that I've got on that particular folder. I then can copy and paste wherever I want. Now, if I want to do the same with text, I can do so. I just need to select the web page that I want, press Control A, it will select all the text. I can then copy and paste on my document. And of course, I can do that from document to document as well. Just need to press on the document that I want, Control A, and then I can copy with Control C, which we have covered on the past video and then I can paste anywhere that I want. And these are the shortcuts for today. Hopefully you found them useful and if you did don't forget that usual thumbs up right over there which is really appreciated on this side of the screen. If you still haven't subscribed to the channel please consider doing it so so that I can keep on delivering this kind of tips. My name is Roberto George and as always I'll see you on the next one.